Think fast, Chuckle Nuts! Hello everyone, Prince Scooter here bringing you another edition of Think Fast. And if you look at the title of this, you'll probably know what it is, but if you didn't, let's go ahead and put in the uh, game of choice here and, uh, well, show you what game I'm going to do today's episode of Think Fast on. I hope you like the new little intro I put in here today too. Probably didn't take me too long to make, but more or less a title for something that's not normal. Anyway. That's right. Today, we're going to play Rhythm Heaven Fever. Now, I have played Rhythm Heaven on, uh, or, was it called just Rhythm Heaven? Yeah, it was called Rhythm Heaven for the DS, so. I have played that game, so I'm a little spoiled. But beyond that, but beyond that, I have not even touched this game. Like, you'll see right here. No files. Me. Wait, wait, I gotta check. Uh, I gotta check something here. Is President in here? President is not in here. That was one of the options on the DS version. Now, how you hold it is uh, like the remote. You hold it in your hand pointed at the screen. I'm pretty sure I will. I know. I know. For Christ's sake, I know how to play Rhythm Heaven. Sure. Alright. Okay, so really this is what you're gonna have me Okay, that was really stupid. Okay, I don't care. Seriously game, I know how to play. Sure, I guess. Th is this really what they have you do? Wow, I can't believe this is actually a thing. What's really weird about this is pressing it in rhythm. Wow. Okay, they're really early. Three, five, uh, da, da, da. Four, three, two, one, bam. Four, three, two, one, bam. Stop making me do this with some time, bam. Really? Da, 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 da. Four, three, two, one. Piss off, you stupid little. F Can I? Can I play the game and show the people how it works, please, you stupid little retarded munchkins from Mars? There wasn't even this in the DS game. It was just, here, play. And I still have to do the little tutorial before the... No. Yes, I know. Okay. Okay, so the blue one is just like a uh, beaker and he just stands there and makes weird noises and looks at you expectantly. 
Yes, I'll have fun and play. I'm showing this to the people. God damn. Oh. I thought they were going to do the factory one first, like for the rhythm of heaven. Alright, well, they're, well, for each one of, the, of these games, from what I know, they give you kind of a little tutorial beforehand. Like, kind of like, like this. Yep, and this game, just press A to hit the ball as it flies towards you. Alright. Oh. What the hell? Interesting. Okay, that's cool. Once you get, it's more or less getting the timing down, and then you go from there. But they have music with these games too, so run for it. Please insert a little rhythm, because I need a little background noise. With with some background rhythm, with some background rhythm, it's a lot easier to do these. Because the, and it usually goes with the song too, so it's not even that hard to do like like that. <laughs> so I'll probably pause every now and again in between this, just because of how. Yes, it was. Hi, big guy. Maybe. Oh. Wow. Interesting. Stupid idiot. First time playing this particular game. <laughs> okay, let's try it again. Thank you. That's really easy. Wow, he whips that thing across. That's awesome. <laughs> All right. So now they're gonna show. So now. So now they're gonna give us that to it in the full. Crap. They're gonna switch it up. So you basically, if there's different timing. You have to listen to which one is making the noise. The monkey will be easier to hit. When he throws it, you basically got to hit it early, otherwise it's not going to go. It's pretty obvious what's going on here, but it's hard. It's actually kind of hard. So let's do the actual. So now it gets to the actual song. So you see how the game works a bit? It's kind of hard for me to talk to you at the same time and play this because I'm kind of trying to trying to keep with the rhythm while I hit the balls and talk to you. <laughs> but it's really fun. I really recommend this game to anyone just for my DS experience. And this is no different than the DS. Oh shoot! And there are perfect rankings. Like you get perfects on these games too and get different scores. And they just change up the rhythm all the time. I wish you could golf like this guy. I want to golf like this guy. Just swing with the rhythm of a beat and get perfect shots in the hole. Dude, that hole's going to be filling up really big time right now. Ow. 
getting really off rhythm. I just gotta think. That monkey's pulling it out of his mouth. The ba the banjo's pulling the balls out of his mouth. It's really weird. Nice. And these games are actually kind of hard too, because if you don't do everything really close to perfect, you can just get an okay. But if you miss a few, they're kind of lenient and say, yeah, you did amazing. But you have to get perfect to get the best ranking. And you get a picture based on how well you did. So I'm pretty sure it'd be like, you know, more practice if you got okay, or if you failed. Yeah, things like that. But. Yeah, this game was really fun. It was fun when I played it on the DS. Hello. What are these? Oh, this. They kept the cafe in. Screwbot Factory. And, uh. No, I just want to go to this. See what the hell's going on. Hey, welcome. Yep. So you can listen to some of the music of the game, read some things, test your rhythm like on the opening screen, like there was in the tutorial, things of that sort. But I guess uh, we'll go through one more of these mini games, and this this mini game I think is going to be similar to one from the DS version. But you, but it'll give you kind of feel of how they change up the music throughout the game. Now, if you're wondering on price. If you're ordering a prices game, it's actually fairly cheap. It's actually cheaper than any 3DS game out right now. This game is $30 US, which I believe would be... Correct me if I'm wrong, because I don't do... Uh, I don't live in England, so I don't know actual currency over there. Uh, 30... or It's, uh, it's got to be something like 23 pounds, 30 euros, something like that. Um, only bad thing about this is... This is only out in Japan and America right now. So if you, so those of you that are across the pond watching this, you'll have to import it from Japan or import it from either Japan or the U.S. Cause, uh, cause the release date for England is still set as uh, the release date in England is still set as uh, what day was that? It still says quarter one, even though quarter one ends at the end of the current month that I'm recording this in, or actually posting this in. So I'm gonna post it right away. Okay. Three, four. Three, four. Three, so yeah. Four. Okay, that's getting you used to hitting both A and B. You'll find yourself hitting the button really hard to stick to stick to the rhythm and then letting go so it's really loud. Three, four. Oops. Interesting, is that is all Yeah, it's only two beats for that one. So one's four beats, one's two beats, interesting. And that's it. You most of the demonstrations usually take only that much time. So let's go. So that's so yeah, that's four beats. Oops! A broke one! I don't think I'm gonna be passing this one.
Interesting. I probably messed that up for him pretty bad. But still just okay. Now I probably got really close to failing right there where it says try again, so... Yeah. So someone just be aware of that game. It It is pretty... Unfortunately, this one actually is pretty lenient. Rhythm toys are not are actually something you can just mess around with in your, in your spare time. Nothing really too important, but... This game is actually a bit more lenient than the DS version, oddly enough. But still, I recommend it to everybody who has a bit of a musical background, or heck, if you think you're good with the, ryth with the rhythm otherwise, definitely get this game, because you're going to have fun with it. It's just keeping a rhythm. Keeping a rhythm and doing it in time. But... I'm gonna. I'll see you guys later. I'm probably gonna play a bit, a bit of this today. Okay, a lot of this today. But I shall see you. I shall see you in the future for the next video.